<sighs> what happened? What'd I miss? Not the lamp. Sorry, lamp. Day 22 of dressing up for Halloween. I'm a big old baby. Let's just get right into it. Oh no, I knocked over my plaque of success. This is from Amanda Johns. That's a, that's a hard guess. Y'all made me something? What is it? A goodie bag of jewels, I hope. Yeah. Hey, get out of here. Four leaf clover for good luck. Looks like a coin, but I mean, if you believe hard enough. Uh -huh. Glasses with no things in them, no need. I have perfect vision. Huh? <laughs> I do have a headache. Where does it start? Okay, remove official geocache. Do not remove official geocache. What? <laughs> remove official geocache. Do not remove official. It all just depends on where you start reading. I didn't know if geocache was like Latin for gigantic jump into your face spider. Log sheet. It does kind of look like a log. <laughs> this is for geocaching, which I don't know much about. <gasps> I have to give all these things to geocaching? Oh, don't get attached. There's normally a dog attached to each end. Oh, I, I do. I have to hide all these things as geocaching. Police limo? Why? Why would you need that? Hey, if you're getting robbers left and right, you need to haul them somehow. That's pretty cool. Geocaching, from what little I do know from my sister, is where, like, you hide these out in the wilderness, somewhere safe. You have a log sheet somewhere, and then I think if you find one of the geocaching places, you take something and leave something. Some places are you just leave something. Some places are you just take something. I don't know. Something like that. I will figure it out. And then they made me this geocaching bag, which is awesome. I'm sorry I have to hide all of you. Hair color spray on shampoo out. Hmm? Temporary blue. How temporary? How blue? Amanda Johns, thank y'all so much for the amazing gifts. Um, I will geocache with my blue hair. Thank y'all so much. I've always almost thought about having blue hair. <laughs> for those days you need comfort of some extra protection. Lori, P.S. We love your videos. Adult briefs, well, <laughs> I've changed quite a few a diaper in my day, so let's see if I can, well, how appropriate for my costume. Excuse me as I try to lay on my back and change my own diaper. My life has come full circle at this point. Gotta grab my legs and lift them up. Is this how you do it? Do grown adults lay on the floor to put these on? Ah, I feel so protected. This is from Kat. Kate. Thank you, Kat. I was also so excited. I didn't even say thank you, Lori, for the for the the big old um dundies. Well, Pikachu backpack for Autumn, not me. I see you sneaking cards to her. No way. Let's see what we got. Oh, they're fake. Oh good, she don't know the difference between real and fake Pokemon cards. But I do, I ain't gonna let her trade her Wigglytuff for my Ninetales, no way, no how. Although her Wigglytuff now has over 9,000 HP, which would kill my Ninetales any day. That's awesome, thank you for that. Oh, that's a whole stack of Pokemon cards. Well, let's look at them. I used to sell Pokemon cards on eBay for a living. I'll let you know if you had anything good. You could probably get like, 15 bucks out of this Charizard. It's pretty banged up. Eight bucks out of this Venusaur. Oh, the cards started to become upside down. I'm too into it to flip them over. There's that nine tails. This is fun for me. I'm done opening gifts today. I'm gonna look at Pokemon cards. <laughs> Any of the original legendary birds, they sell pretty good. I've sold this Zapdos for upwards of almost 50 bucks. You want these cards back now or what? Uh, this promo Mewtwo now is worth over $400. So, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's practically worthless. It ain't worth nothing. Autumn will love these. I love them. I want to collect them again. Nostalgia was never so expensive. Oh, I forgot there's more to the gift. Whoa, a binder to put all the cards in. Well, let's, we're gonna end this early. I'm just gonna put it out there. Does anybody here collect Pokemon cards? Y'all want to trade? Because I'm gonna start collecting them. You have convinced me, a full grown man, to start collecting Pokemon cards again. I'm still wearing a diaper. Kate. Thank you, Cat. Autumn will love them, um, but I, I will not give them to her, so they're mine. Ooh, P is for Pterodactyl, and T is for Tsunami. What is this? Sandy, puffy, fluffy, fluffy unicorn needle felt. Yum. Well, you don't need it, do you? Well, that'll be fun. I'll try that. I have a couple of those. Amazon, you really messed these up. I'm sure there's a name on here. I can't see it. I'm so sorry. Harry Potter joke book. Why wasn't Voldemort at the Yule Ball? He had nobody to go with. <laughs> Nobody. 
from whoever. I don't know. I'm sorry I didn't see the name. I love it. Thank you for the joke books. I am starting to do stand-up. I'm not opposed to ripping off other people. You got any jokes, Kelly? I heard that some of y'all showed up Monday to open mic, and that just so happened to be the one day I couldn't go. I'm going this Monday, for sure, for sure. Please open before 10-1. Crap. <laughs> it's 10-21. This is from Jackie Manning from 365 Scrapbooking. It's a lot of scrapbooks. Check them out. Oh, Beebs and Autumn eat candy and make a video. Hello, friends. That's that's my that's my baby. She's five, six, whatever. <laughs> oh, I love that. So I'm hanging it up. That's super cute, Jackie. Thank you so much, Ferris fam. Oh, that's me and my fam. Ah, uh, that's before I had blue hair, and that's when she was five. <laughs> they grow up so fast, Kelly. What? Little origami stars. How? Did what? <coughs> this is from Michelle. Thank you, Michelle. I love the gifts. <coughs> I don't know how you did those stars. These diapers starting to chafe. Did you powder me? Oh, I did it myself. Did I powder me? Fragile, no bugs. That's that's never true. This is from Anne Posel. Posel? She put in parentheses long O sound. I don't know what a long O sound is. Posel. She said it's jewelry, but people have lied to me before. Etsy.com slash and strange designs. I hope you love your item. It's a Bob Ross magnet. It's a voodoo Bob Ross, by the way. Bob, you have like 27 buttons on your shirt and it's still not buttoned up all the way. <laughs> you dirty dooter. You're painting a unicorn. And thank you so much. That's incredible. You'll hold up my coffee coupon. This is from Shelby, Kim, and Brittany, the tribe family. Happy little tree. Love that. Ooh, these things that I still don't know how to do. Sour warheads. I like those. Keep. From The Secret Life of Pets. Oh, these are all little cat toys. Well, they're gonna be, regardless of what they were. Thank you all so much for the cat toys. Shelby, Kim, and Brittany, I appreciate it. Um, she has this tiny little unicorn. Oh, she did, RIP. Um, she ripped the butt out of it. <laughs> all the beans started filling, falling out of the butt. I don't know, she, she does weird things when we're not home. From the McDonald's family. This is from Ella. I cut it. I'm sorry. <laughs> From Aaron, Greg, Ella, and Seth McDonald. Thank y'all. These are all for Kate. Kate. Is that a little hood? I've been dressing up this whole month, and Kate hasn't been dressing up once. A little hood for my cat. Good luck. <laughs> Does it come with band-aids? McDonald family. Thank y'all so much. Kate. We'll love it. I'm gonna dress her up in this, but if y'all don't see me for a while, it's because I tried to dress her up in this. P.S. I'm expecting a joke about my last name. Make it a good one. What's your last name? You gotta tell it to me first. Pigeon? <laughs> Nadine Pigeon. Nadine, did you make all this yourself or did someone help him pigeon? <laughs> that's pretty good. Get, that's a six, okay? Out of all the last name jokes I've made, that's a solid six. Six. Autumn. You would know if the camera would focus. Gotta feed the babies. Super cool. All these are so cool. Stamp out loud. Check them out. They make good stuff. Thank you, Nadine. From Kevin and Elizabeth and Lily. Whoa! Is this Canadian money? Ha ha! Canadian money. Is that enough to buy Tim Hortons or no? Oh, a cat laser. Need batteries. Heavy Metal, the Encyclopedia of Heavy Metal. What? That's a big old book. Jimi Hendrix, Queen, Ozzy. King's X. I uh, love them. Dream Theater. Heck yeah. John Mayung. Weird choice for the picture. Thank y'all so much. Pokemon cards and heavy metal. I am a whole mood. More Tim Hortons money. Thank y'all so much. I love the book and the, the cat toys. Psych pillowcase. Now I have two. <gasps> Suck it. If you don't watch Psych, you should. From Emily Schultz. Emily, thank you so much. I do love it. <gasps> a Wooly Willy. You only have a second to see it. How was it? I haven't done a Wooly Willy in a Willy Wong time. Casey Carroll Art. <laughs> uh, check them out. From Casey Carroll. Is that a donut bag? Oh, that's cool. A Wooly Willy hat mask? How did you do that? Earrings. Yarn genius. Yeah, you are. Bob Ross Energy Drink. Jennifer Davis. Thank you, Jennifer. I'm not allowed to have them because my liver is broke. I don't what? I'm doing a liver detox. I still love it. Thank you, Jennifer. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. 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 
I don't know what's in there. This is from Robert Sapp and Ashley, Gabriel, Ryan, and Robbie. Okay, it's not a, it's not a bug. What? Good. He what? Well, he made it. It's Bob Ross riding a unicorn. How do I do it? Oh, it's too fancy for me to even unsheath. Robert Sapp. It's all handmade. Even the box was made from a tree. Well, all are. Custom pins. They helped. What? Y'all are extremely talented. That's amazing. Robert, thank you so much for putting this together. It's really awesome. This is so cool. Love these. Autumn plays with these and so does the cat. If you like yell or make a loud noise, then they'll do their thing. This hog never sweats. That's not healthy for the hog. Oh, wow. What? Ooh, that's, that's a mug. No wonder you don't sweat. Unicorn tumbler. I have to go all the way out here. That's how big it is. You match my hair. From Lorna and Jamie, I think. Thank y'all so much. That thing's huge. I can put all my Starbucks drinks in there. Perishable. Well, aren't we all? What is this? What kind of stuff is this unicorn into? I like the outfit. That's cool. Chain mail. So the cat won't completely eat you. Well, she might. Good luck. This is from Annette Johnson. And the unicorn with the unique pajamas is from What the Cat Made. Cool business card. Check them out. I guess there's a whole bunch of gluten-free snacks in here, which, good, I am hungry. What is this? I'm not gonna eat this. Microwave popcorn on the cob. Okay, that's cool, I'm gonna try that. <gasps> Scrubbers, brown rice spaghetti. Oh, I'm eating that. Bread mix. Oh, you remember bread, Kelly? Annette, thank you so much. Um, it is hard finding gluten-free stuff, so thank you. Now I have dinner. Ooh, I remember these. I can go forever. <gasps> Let's break the world record. Oh, that feels like it's gonna hurt when it hits my shin. Oblong scarf. Oh, how long is it? Eek. Disc pin refillable. What? You're a pen? Oh, I don't want to rip your head off. This is from Lindsay Edens. Lindsay? Oh, what? Hello? What? Hold on, I'll get you out of there. I'm coming. No, no. I'm coming. Ah, no, I'm sorry. Now breathe, tell me what happened. No way. <laughs> Calm down. Hey. That's it? Okay. Lindsay, I love it. I don't know what this is, but... Uh-huh. I love it. Thank you so much for the gifts for Gloria and Autumn. I will give them their gifts. Kathalina Armijo. All about bows. Pikachu, Batman, and then triangles. Thank you all about bows. Calligraphy and hand lettering notepad. <gasps> I wanna learn calligraphy. No, no. What? Whoever sent me the calligraphy, thank you so much. This is from Heather Smith. Cajun Creations. A t-shirt. Oh, that's soft. That's a soft shirt. God is bigger than Chiari. You, t you told me how to pronounce this, but I forgot. Kiari. Ki I think, uh, hopefully I'm saying that right. Thank you so much for the shirt, Heather. Thank you for the letter. I loved it. Thank you so much for thinking of me and for sending me this shirt. That's the best I've ever folded a shirt in my life. Jeer Jesus, Brandon Ferris. This is from the Anders fam. They wrote their own book? Currently in the fifth grade. Fifth grade, and you wrote the book. Okay, no, that's fine. I've done things too in my life, Kelly. Have you seen? The Lamp Hour Left by Elizabeth Grace Anders. It's on Amazon, go check it out. Oh, there's correct punctuation everywhere. Oh, you have the, you have it. Elizabeth, congrats on writing a book at fifth grade. I'm a 28 year old man wearing a diaper. I love it. Thank y'all so much for sending me the book. This is from Ray Dean. Whoa, a little cat collar uh, with a bazillion diamonds on it. Okay, how many diamonds does your ring have? Oh wow, that's a lot too. I'm, I'll shut up. Has a little crown too. Princess Zelda. Oh, this is cool. Again, I don't think she'll let me put it on her, but I will try. Ray Dean, thank you so much. You made this? Royal Pet Stuff on Facebook. Go check them out. What is this? The Geek's Cookbook. Every recipe inspired by Pokemon, Harry Potter, and Star Wars. Oh yeah, now that's my book. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, Game of Thrones. Yeah, baby. Magikarp with chorizo sauce. Oh, that's cool. They have a bunch of stuff in here. Final Fantasy, Minecraft, Game of Thrones. Oh yeah, that's gonna be fun. I'm gonna do a video with these. Who's this from? Who and who did this and who? Whoever sent the book, thank you so much. We're just gonna go ahead and do the box of the week where y'all have to guess what's in it. I'm just realizing I didn't leave one for next week. I'll figure it out. 
But before we open this box, every single week we donate ad revenue from YouTube and Facebook. We donate it to a charity of y'all's choice. This week, um, we are going to donate to the Montgomery County Law Enforcement Officer Relief Fund from Vixen Dream 1993 on YouTube. She said, I don't know what qualifies as a charity for your donations. Anything. It doesn't have to be a like a 501c3 we've given to people. We give to just about anything. So as long as they accept donations online and you feel like it's a, a good cause to donate to, comment and uh, we'll do that. Now we're going to open the box, see what's in it. Oh, a box inside of another box. Snuggle Kitty Anxiety Solution. And y'all aren't getting this. How do I squeeze it? How do I just hug it? Your heart don't work. Well, that don't ease my anxiety. <laughs> That's cool. Put the heart in the cat. The cat purrs. This is from Kristen. PV at Smart Pet Love. Oh no, my diapers come undone. Um, she will eat this thing. That's really cute though. Look at the cute picture of the cats. I love cats, Keep. Kristen, thank you so much. Thank you for being the box of the week. Thank you for the gift. Zelda will love it. And then she might rip, is there beans in the butt? Cause she'll find a way to get those out. Now we're gonna go to YouTube and Facebook, read the comments, see who is even close. Almost everyone always says something for Zelda. So I'm not gonna count any, any answer that says something for Zelda. We're gonna see if someone can get specific. Jody Rice says, uh, you should come to Australia. Um, no, your spiders are people, okay? They're as big as me. I don't, no, 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 I would die. Have you seen how small the spiders I react to are? Thank you for the invite, Jody. but it's, it's gonna be a no for me, a hard one. Angie Benjamin says, why do you wear that t-shirt, Yard House Cafe or something? <laughs> Was I wearing this last week in the opening? Um, yes, this is where I got fired, but it was 100% my fault. No hard feelings at all. It's just a really comfortable shirt. And go eat at Yard House. It's good food. I don't know. Kelsey Blankenship says, ornament something for Zelda. It's not an ornament. Oddly enough, the closest thing. <laughs> Screenshot it. Okay, I've been through so many comments. We're gonna check YouTube. From back here. Mi adios. No one else is gonna get it. That's it. That's fifth comment I read. Done. The box of the week. Harry Potter or Bob Ross or kitty item for Zelda. Sounded like a box inside of a box. <laughs> it was! It was a box inside of another box. I even said it myself, I think. I don't remember. That's it. Mia Rios, you, you won. I'm gonna message you right now. Thank you to everybody who commented, uh, to everybody who guessed. Let me go find something that we can guess. Oh, this should be a fun one. Feels like a shirt, a clothing of some sort. Hold on. Guess what's on this article of clothing. You don't, if it's not a shirt, just guess what's on it. Whoever's closest will win something. Love y'all. Thank you for all the guesses, all the gifts. I still have a diaper on.